Welcome back to Dredge for the Iron Rig DLC, which released about nine hours ago. I completely forgot to report the uh, uh, the Pale Reach DLC. I do apologize for that. I just kind of played it as it was. Very fun. Pretty cool area. And I have a crab trap that I completely forgot about. And they're just all the stuff that I have rounds. Okay. There's the rig. Already slightly mad, but we can do that. It's been a hot minute since I played Dredge. Nothing in my inventory. Still got all my stuff. I uh, basically just picked up from where I left off from the uh, good ending, bad ending video that I did for the ending of it, and I really wish I had remembered to uh, take the take a recording of the Pale Reach DLC. Would have been nice, but no, I'm just a big old dum dum head and forgot to do that. But for now, let's get started with this. As soon as I get over there. Cruising okay. right. speed. Okay, for some reason the dock is not the dock. No, oh, it is the dock. There we go. You dock at a small metal wharf, four giant legs stretch down into the deep, lifting a mountain of metal into the sky. An elevator connecting to the docking area to the main platform lies ahead. A man waits nearby, a yellow hard hat strapped to a concerned expression. Oh. What do you want? What is this place? <sighs> Haven't you heard? This is the Iron Haven Corporation's new drilling rig. Or it would be if we were on schedule. Right now, it's just a platform. Uh. The boss is gonna dock our pay for sure if he shows up and sees that the drill hasn't even been started. We've got the foundational stuff laid, but we've been running into the, some supply issues. He glances nervously at the water, large waves rolling underneath the shadow of the platform. The ships delivering crates of materials keep going missing, and HQ says they're not gonna be able to dispatch any more for a few weeks. Uh. Look. I wouldn't normally ask a civilian for help, but we're already so far behind. Why did I mark the last known co coordinates of those ships on your map? Hmm. If you're able to find any of those crates, I'm sure the corp will let us use, will let you use our facilities. Once we get the generator wired up, that is. Iron Haven crates. Yeah, did the pale reach? Haven't done this one, or. This one, which is ah crap, I forgot about that. Whatever. Uh, Mort at the Iron Haven Corporation's new rig being built north of the Marrows spoke the f to the foreman of the project. Sounds like they need some help with getting the generator going. Apparently, their material shipments have started going missing. They only need a few things, and they'll let me use their new facilities if I help out. The foreman had the last known coordinates of their shipping vessels marked in and marked them on my map. Take a look, see. Oh, oh, there's a few of them. I imagine if I get them all, then I'd probably get a bonus thing. But, uh, yeah. It's too on dark. First one is right to here. I'd call that the Iron Haven Corporation stuff. What is this? 
Oh, shit, that's a crab. I swear I remembered a crab being there, but I thought it was the plane. Completely spaced on that crab being there. Giant freaking mi mimic crabs. Evil bastards. But yeah, I've been looking forward to this DLC for a while. Though I do wish they had taken my idea, one of my ideas, uh, for the DLC mm. when they were taking suggestions. If you're able to find any of those crates, I'm sure the core blah blah blah. Yeah, yeah, I was here. I already did this. Here's one. Uh, yeah. Wait. Huh. This ought to be enough to get the generator going. I'll get these materials sent up to the main platform. Keep it unlocked. Missing shipment. Deliver the missing shipment to the rig. Oh, well, that should be in working order, but I just checked the storeroom and it looks like we never got any fuel deliveries. I did find this, though. You can use it to patch things up in a pinch. Keep it. The least I could do in return for your help. Old repair kit. Oh! Oh, that's very nice. I like that. Uh. Well, I gotta go and figure out the fuel situation. Why don't you go introduce yourself to the head scientist? He's always interested to hear more about the local fish species. Science Lab! You approach an old man, pacing back and forth near a cordoned-off area on the main platform. He's muttering to himself quietly. Ah. Who are you? Ah, the angler-turned-courier, isn't that right? The workers were talking about you. All good things, I promise. Say, you must know a great deal about the fish species around here, yes? What have you encountered in these waters? You wouldn't believe me if I, if I fucking told you. Instead of rolling his eyes, as most people do when they sense a fisherman's tail approaching, the scientist's eyes glisten with an intense curiosity. Ah. Is that so? Perhaps you'll find me a little more imaginative than others. Uh. Before we get into all of that, though, it seems my laboratory is also a victim of a missing shipment supply. Conveniently enough, I have one. I was planning on conducting research into fish species in the area, but I can't do that without somewhere to study. Oh, you've got enough materials for the science lab now, too, huh? We'll get to work. Uh, I love how fast that's done. That should be enough space for your tubes and fluids, eh? There's like eight dozen different ways that could have been phrased better, but probably. Yes, more than sufficient for my needs. Thank you, both of you. Ah. Fisherman, considering you're not on the corpse payroll, why don't you take this? A small token of my appreciation. Oh, cool. Anti-madness stuff. The foreman turns to you. Hmm. I think we have a solution for our fuel problem. Come see me at the generator, and I'll give you the rundown. I'm really curious about oh. the science lab. How can I help you? How long have you worked for these people? <sighs> My whole professional career has been dedicated to scientific research at the corporation. So that's... Well, north of half a century. Our current executive's father hired me when I was fresh out of college. He must have seen something me all those years ago. Hmm. <sighs> Though it turns out the fuel never got dispatched from Iron Haven at all. I was on the radio to HQ, apparently this is a biofuel generator. So new tech the corp wanted to trial out here, and they're expecting us to supply it ourselves. <sighs> Thing is, they didn't think to outfit us with any gear for harvesting biomass, and the fleet services construction is way down on the project. Think you could help us out again? Hmm. You can add fish or most other biological material, I suppose, to the hopper here. Once it's filled, we have to have enough to start the drill. Okay, I am gonna pass out for the day, go fish up a whole bunch of stuff, and then come right on back. Woo! Love how cruising my boat gets. There's the Oh, that's how I keep my things. Oh, I see. Forgot how I saw my uh, markers.
snake mackerel. Slender with dull black eyes and a long snout. A greedy, fall, a greedy jaw full of long, sharp teeth. I can read English. And this one should probably get me. Not the greatest sorting job, but... Marginally better than what it was. That's ah, fine. Oh, another Iron Haven crate. And I think I'll call it there. That's no good down there. I see that. I don't like that. Cruising speed. Don't blow up my engine. Actually, I have to fit things in properly. Hmm. I'll go get some more reasonably sized fish. There is one. Something normal size. Ooh, this thing. Oh, there we go. There's something normal size. Do me. Cruising speed because I'm fast as fuck, boy. Hmm. Ah. It won't hold anymore. I'll fire it up. The crushing compactor clunks to life. The sound of pneumatic pistons and strange squelching soon gives way to the stuttering sound of distant gears. Aha! We've done it! A large capsule drops from the chute labeled waste. Through its clear walls, you can see remnants of fish you deposited. Huh. Or, well, you'll probably be able to use that for chum, right? It's yours if you want it. Uh, a can canister of malignant fish remains adorned with warning stickers and caution labels attracts wretched fish. Ooh, that sounds interesting. Ability unlocked. Bait. Toss bait overboard to attract local, local species. Now we can finally get this drill started. All clear! Initiating drill deployment in three, two, one. The drill descends.
Somehow that doesn't seem like standard operating procedure. The scientist walks over, gripping handrails to counteract the shockwaves from the ah. drill. We've broken through. We're underway at last. But what about that huge crack that opened up? Is the reservoir stable? <sighs> Admittedly, the fissure is larger than my model suggested, but it appears to have stabilized. We should consider halting the drilling for now. Also, we would be remiss in our duties to the local population if we didn't survey the area and gather up some ways, gather up some data. In that vein, fisherman, I have something for you. The factory has recently become operational, allowing us to manufacture equipment infused with the corporation's latest breakthrough. This is a new design. Line passes through a canister of dark fluid, coating and strengthening it. Uh, I don't actually have a this. I suppose I don't need this one. Uh, put that in storage. Because we're not actually doing the glacial one right now. Using that rod, I need you to collect specimen samples from the marrows, just to check that the fish species are unaffected by our operations there. Holy monstrum, paddlefish, sea cucumber, and os osteostracan? I'm not quite sure what that means. And <laughs> yeah, sea cucumber. Type, crab. Boundary? A helmeted figure emerges from the shadows by a building site. He lifts a visor. Uh, Place isn't built yet. He gestures to the pile of materials behind him. Mm. We're short on materials. Once they arrive, we can start working. Hmm. That's all we need. We can get the foundry built now. Hmm. Good to go. Hmm. Basic materials can be worked here. Uh, yeah, they don't actually have enough stuff in storage. I can't remember where I got this. Well, obviously from the DLC, but I didn't get it. Uh, tech Lab. When the Tech Lab is operational, we'll be able to work on projects of more technical nature. I have plans for an interchangeable module system. You'll see. I'll show you when we get upset here, but, uh, one more lot of materials to be able to upgrade your boat's papers functions. Okay, that's pretty neat. Science Lab. How's it going out there? Uh, probably pretty bad. The woman has stood just inside the doorway, sketching a design in an over. Hey there, welcome to the factory. I'm the lead engineer here. Infused rod, infused winch, infused hoist, infused fireproof rod, infused coiling rod. Ah, oh, this is cool stuff. I already got the infused rod. But, uh, this will handle it, huh? Oh, that's actually just straight flat better. Oh, so I, I need... I'm not quite sure what the... I think these might be the new materials that I don't have yet. Okay. Undock. And because I am lazy... Uh, yoink. Okay, sorry, drop my phone. Do not hit the giant basalt pillars. And where is that? Ah, there's the goop. Got a fish in the goop. Oh, there's some goop. I really don't like this goop. Not sure if that's the fishing spot or don't touch that spot. Oh, no, that's not it. Oh, that's okay. Can't touch that. I do not like this goop. I do not like it, Sam I am. I would not like it with a fox. I would not like it in a box. I would not like it here or there. I would not like it with a bear. Are they ever going to do anything with that? Or is that just, hey, I don't want to be here anymore. Let me move over here. Oh, shit. Trying to Tokyo drift that shit. Oh, that's a pretty cool thing. Okay, I'm just gonna drop this shit. It's rotten. Nobody wants it.
called a monstrum. Whoa, that is a big fucker. Turn off the old... No, that's not what I wanted. I want the lights. Turn that shit off so I don't get demolished by those things. And get me back home. And avoid that giant crack in reality, it seems. Oh, wait, no, I remember exactly what that is. That was the portal I set up. You bastard, you took my soothing tea. I don't even know what the hell that thing was. Fishmonger. Huh, I think I go for a neat, decent chunk of change. Uh, where's the drag? Almost got a uh, fully leveled up thing. Did I forget to grab the fucking wood? Uh. Got him, a dumbass. Cute. Harvesting platform. Coastal, shallow, and oceanic. Buildings on the rig, build factory tier two, foundry tier two, the tech lab tier one. Like samples, paddlefish, tola monstrum, osteostracon, and sea cucumber. Which means I will also probably need a crab trap that I don't think I actually have on me. Uh, I will purchase a crab trap from the shipwright. No, that is not where I get crab traps. Where the heck do I get crab traps? Was a thing. Where would I get crab trap? Is that the what's your face lady, the wandering merchant lady? Okay, let's just use this spyglass, save me some time. Paddlefish, that's what I'm looking for. Oh shit. Not so oceanic. That one. Going around. Tokyo drift style. This ooze. I I'll hang on to that, I guess. Uh, paddlefish. These large, slow fish range between uh, range between sluggish rivers and coastal waters. Their numbers are dwindling rapidly. Osteo Osteostracon. This armored jawless fish hunts in strong currents and uses suction to pull smaller fish into its mouth. And Telemonstrum. This bizarre creature feeds with a mouth on the end of a long proboscis. Two eyes swivel on delicate, spindly stalks. That's kind of neat. Yeah, it's the portal that I set up. I had crab traps. That's not where I'm going. I think I get them from the the wandering merchant lady. Let's speed things up a little. And don't blow up my engine. Because that's really expensive to replace. I don't want to 
deal with the goat piranhas again. Hmm. Miscellaneous. Oh shit, I can buy research parts here? Baller. Where the heck do I get the crab traps here? Hmm. Oh, here's the crab traps. I am just dumb. I'm gonna go drop these off first. Avoid the goat piranhas, because I don't want to deal with them. They're assholes. There's the Iron Haven Core. Very nice and easy to see. Uh, did you give up? I think you gave up. I was thinking that little tiny island was going to turn into a crab and try to kill me. Ah. That was the guy who wanted something, but I don't think I ever actually picked up his quest. I'm on my way. And... Don't blow up my engines. Hey, fisherman. Thanks again for your help filling that generator. I've reported our new operational status to HQ. In fact, they've given me a budget to compensate you for any additional biomass you bring in. Just see me at the generator and I'll pay you. Hmm. Okay, so... A figure emerges from the lower decks and beckons you over into the shadows. Mm -hmm. If you're gonna be hanging around, maybe we can do business. Come see me at the Undermarket. Alone. Uh, science lab. Mm. I have mm. three samples. The paddlefish here, the telemonstrum here, and the osteostracon here. We we'll need sea cucumber, but I'll get that. What's the purpose mm. of it? Well, I can't go into specifics, you understand, but the purpose of this platform is to test a crucial hypothesis that I've been working towards for years. If my hypothesis proves correct, it'll yield a significant asset for the corporation's business diversification strategy. What, what are you going to diversify the business into? Mm. Ah, yes, I believe the drill has already stopped operating. The foreman should be making preparations to withdraw it from the seabed. It's not something you can just yank out, apparently. The drill team will take their time to try to ensure minimal disturbance. Yeah, that makes sense. I don't think you'd want to buy this stuff. Got some items you might be interested in. Don't ask where they come from. Better off not knowing. You can make some basic repairs too, but it'll cost you. Okay, so this guy's just the new merchant guy. I mean, I got cash, but I'm not exactly strapped for it. What is this? What do I do with this? I feel like it's bad to have, especially because I can discard it. Mm. Not anymore. Uh, ah. mm. oh. Nope, not at all. Okay. I'll rest. Right. Okay, coming up on 30 minutes. I'm just gonna go set that first crab trap. And uh, then I'm probably gonna just call it for this episode here. Wanna take a look, see if there's any more of those boxes around here. No. Oh, do I have any information on the sea cucumber thing? Depth 0 to 82 feet, so I imagine coastal. Well, there's an Iron Haven boat right this way, so might as well stop by. Going a little over 30 minutes ain't gonna kill me. It's gonna make my episode the uh, file size kind of big. Didn't need to do 
do that. Perfect. That should be coastal stuff. Nice stuff. Shallow. Shallow and coastal, I guess. Spot as any. Okay. Well, I think that's gonna be it for right now. I'm just gonna get this squared away, take a rest, and then head grab the thing, head back to the Iron Haven Corporation. Ooh, sweet. Uh, I'll probably be picking up the uh, next episode right after finishing this one. I'm just gonna try to get the whole thing recorded today if I can. We've got another hour or so before I gotta make dinner, so I should be good to go. Probably try to get another episode or two recorded today. And if I can't get it all done today, then I'll try to get some more done tomorrow. But, uh, hope you guys are playing the DLC too. Wow, that's a lot of research parts. I am not complaining about that. Uh, hope you guys are enjoying the DLC as well. Uh, let me know if there's any other games that you guys are looking forward to. I'm certainly looking forward to Space Marine 2 coming out. Gonna be playing that with my buddy. Uh, not Nazi TTV on, uh, Twitch. I'll probably drop a, uh, Link to his channel. If he's okay with that, up to, up to him. Oh, good lord, there's a lot of stuff here. Must have been sitting for a while. Uh, but uh, definitely going to be playing that. Uh, I'm also very, very much looking forward to uh, the Plucky Squire, which I will also drop a link for. Uh, because that game just genuinely looks phenomenal. It's a very, very unique premise. Is she? Once again, okay. Doesn't care, just doesn't want to be over tomorrow. Uh, but uh, thank you all for tuning in, and I will see you in the next one.